Hey there, you're watching the Jessa channel on YouTube. I'm Jessa, and this is Pathfinder Kingmaker, the Enhanced Edition. And we are playing as Zara Fae's sister, a druid, and her companion, Bracken. In today's episode, we're going to attempt to take down the rats at Ratnook Cave, uh, at Ratnook Hill. Um, and if we can't do that, because we've tried several times and gotten our butts handed to us, <laughs> then we'll move on to the Stag Lord. But no matter what, Zara will be facing her nemesis, the Stag Lord, and the evil druid who is responsible for all of this. Well, you can't see it right now, but uh, the fog that has besieged the land. And so we're going to, we have uh, bought our, our supplies and we are going to take our party out with us. We are also going to be taking with us, now in our last attempts we had Harim with us and we've come to the startling discovery that he is really not a great tank. <laughs> he really isn't. So that means that he's going to have to go. And we're going to have to add Valerie in here and remove her rim. This spot is always kept open for, um, for Bracken. The party stands before Ratnook Hill. It is a notable hill that got its name and its nasty reputation when rats swarmed it in huge numbers. We have buffed our party. Valerie is taken reduced person to make her harder to hit. Bracken has acid maw um, and mage armor. And you can see some other buffs that he has here. Zara um, has heroism. Um, Valerie has aid. And so if we can't do this, we also have resist energy. Uh, protection from fire, and we have here, resist energy, yes, uh, communal. And so if we can't do this, then I think it's time to go on and see if we can't kick the Stag Lord's butt and come back and see if these wear rats are easier when we hit level five. But let's give it a try. The party enters and find, them, find themselves immediately under, under attack by wear rats. Luckily, Valerie and... Um, um, uh, Bracken are the ones that are currently being targeted, which is what we want. So, uh, the battle begins with the were rat taking his first turn. Oh, he did a lot of damage on Valerie, but Valerie is still up. Let's give ourselves some Inspire Courage. We're going to really need that. Um, it's going to give us a morale ba bonus and a, a competence bonus on attack and weapon damage rolls, which is what we really need. Bracken's turn. Bracken, I need a trip, buddy. I need a trip. Come on, Bracken. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, we can now see him. So he's going to come into play as well, too. Uh, Lindsay, can you do ear piercing scream on him? Yes, it worked. That means he is now dazed. Now let's move on to Tristian. And Tristian, I wonder if you can do a hold person on this one here. Or actually this one. He's just in range, so hopefully you don't have to move. Did that work? Will saving throw failed. Wonderful. Will is this particular enemy's lowest. So we now have two wear rats out of the fight. Valerie, um, can you continue to try and intimidate? And he is now shaken. Wonderful. Wonderful. We might actually, we might actually win this. Don't talk too soon, but we might. Um, Zara, you can continue on with that. Yes. Woo. Oh my God. Oh my God, that is so amazing. I'm so happy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
It is the were rat's turn. He went at Valerie, but Valerie is still up. Harem would have been dead by now. Let's just, I'm bitter, yes. Bracken, it is time for a charge. Let's take this guy down. Yes. Tristian, you're doing a good job of keeping uh, her alive. So now it would be a good time to cast a scroll of prayer uh, for one round to, debil to give us some buff and debilitate the enemy. Lindsay, I need you to take this dude down. Let's get some certain damage. And down he goes. Wonderful. Woo! Yes. Um, Valerie. Valerie, you need to charge this guy. 100%. So we can get some flanking bonuses going on now. Let's go like this. There we go. And there's that trip. The beloved trip. We're saved. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Ooh, use magic device for you. Oh, and what happened there at the end? Let's pause there. What happened at the end of that battle? Because all you saw was everybody take damage. What happened was the last thing was her use magic device check failed. And then Bracken makes an attack of opportunity. Valerie makes an attack of opportunity. Valerie um, attacks with the masterwork sword. She does zero damage, but Bracken attacks with bite and gets a critical hit. And with that, with that critical, our enemy has been defeated. Yes! Woo! Woo! Go team, go! <laughs> After collecting some loot and Bracken making sure that the cave was completely empty of any trouble, the party actually forgot to check this corner. <laughs> okay, never mind. Okay. The party just wanted to see. <laughs> um, the party heads out gratefully to the fresh air. So um, if you are new here and you want to know when I am live so you can catch me, um, I am live every Friday at usually, I was late today, at 2 p.m. Pacific. The party, feeling rather tired, but elated, triumphant, uh, Valerie passes around a, a, um, a you know, a, a water bottle and, uh, a, you know, a water tankard of some sort, you know, some sort of traveling tankard type thing, you know, and uh, Octavia whistles happily and Bracken, as usual, pads along um, in front of the party looking out for, um, you know, any challenges that they may meet on the road. As they come to um, a fork in the road, Zara says, I believe we are ready for the Stag Lord. And Lindsay says, yes, let's take him on. And so the party heads south towards the Stag Lord's fortress. After having traveled for some time, the party find themselves in need of a bit of rest. I said the party finds themselves. There we go. <laughs> for goodness sakes. <laughs> and then what will we have for dinner today? Let's go for shepherd's pie because it just sounds really good. Really, really good. I'm glad that being a slave didn't harden your heart. You are very strong. I... I'm just the way I am. I think my owners wanted me to become as wicked as they were. So I did the opposite out of spite. Wonderful. And we have been healed. And we have a nice blessing. So we should... We can go into this fight a little more prepared. The party arrives at a well-fortified bandit stronghold and the residence of the Stag Lord himself, which is built on the site of ancient Iobarian ruins. And in the next episode, we will head on in and fight the Stag Lord. 
If you're watching this live, hang out with me. We are not, the live stream is not ending. But if you're watching this later on on YouTube, I want to thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed what you saw in Pathfinder Kingmaker, the Enhanced Edition, please hit the thumbs up button below. And if you loved it, join the party and subscribe. I'll see you next time with more of Zara's story. And thanks as always for watching.